thesmartlocal.com. Ez volt tovább, Ali. Horoscopes. Yes, I do take a reference point from all these horoscopes. I like to read the love horoscope. So off, but only into my own horoscope. I don't care about other people, I care about myself. Sometimes, I don't follow or like hardcore be like, okay, today like my horoscope said this and I'll do this. I do not eh. <laughs> I'm more of like, uh, give me fact and information, not dust. Do you know what's your horoscope and its traits? Yes, my horoscope is cancer. Cancer is like a crap, you know. So for me, I outside like, mm, Nah, like that, uh, but my insight is like I know I'm a Capricorn. I don't really know much about horoscopes trait. Aquarius, I am someone who is very affectionate, Aww. very sensitive, very emotional. At the same time, I enjoy freedom. Okay, I know this because Fauzi is always emphasizing that Taurus are very stubborn. Then he say I'm like that. It's a coincidence! <laughs> to what extent do you think these traits are accurate? It's like that, lor. this is the bowl of salt, lor. then you do like that. Whatever you describe as Aquarius, it's me. On this episode of Singaporeans Tribe, you'll be letting your horoscope decide your life for 72 hours. Oh my god! I'm actually happy! <laughs> this is basically like everything I don't believe in, okay? <laughs> One of the horoscope challenge as a cancer that was born between June 21st to July 22nd. You are very emotional and sensitive. Wow, this one I tell you, all my ex girlfriend here already confirm agree. Right? You hate taking advice. Mm, not really, la, but have great memory. I don't think I can. You have an artistic taste for things. That's why I'm the video producer. As a Capricorn that was born between December 22nd to January 19th, you're often sarcastic but extremely kind at heart. <laughs> Do you have a hard time accepting differences of other people? You still try to get along. And sometimes I'm just like, we're very different, but I'll try to you know make friends with you. I don't like people to feel left out. That's the thing. Maybe because I always left out last time. And I did a quick search on my laptop on what are some of the Aquarius traits that I should have. Folks with the Aquarius signs are well suited to being objective and persuasive when it comes to solving problems between two parties. Project manager, which is literally my job scope and what I do in TSL. However, they're unpredictable. So we'll see if this actually works because my first challenge is to plan and follow a routine. Okay, as a Taurus, you are practical and well grounded. Yep, yep. Your priority now is to buy a house. Okay. You don't like taking risks and you are often stubborn. Stubborn, correct? <laughs> but I think he likes taking risks. You started your own business, so that uh, is a risk. Yeah. Yet. You are always planning ahead. Mm. Ah, yes. We buy a house. Yeah. <laughs> so, so my day one outfit is like this. Uh. It's just a normal t-shirt. My pants is the jogger. Can you see? So far, I would say it is a 95% heat. This is the, 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 the outfit that the, pro, the producer showed me. But they are all tapo one, no? Okay lah, if you convert it to like a bit of tapo one uh, About there lah, about there. Bruh. Later, I'm gonna have a Zoom call with the producers. Uh, they're gonna surprise me with the challenge of the day. Bring it on! So, the producers actually give me a set of clothing color tones to follow. So, I actually chose this. So, this cream pants and a top. This is my outfit. It's neutral. Yeah, I'm quite liking this outfit, honestly. Like, I will wear this. So, maybe how are you wearing my outfit today? 10 out of 10. So, do you think it's like a Capricorn thing? I don't look at the horoscope, so I have no idea. Mm. But if that's what the Capricorn is, then just do that more often. Okay, okay. It is um, 7.40 in the morning. 7.45, I am going to do a morning workout. Seven fifty nine a.m. This planning thing is annoying me already. <laughs> Maybe I'll plan it though. Is that cheating? I don't know. Hi guys. Hi. Yo. yo. Bowling will have to answer questions about you. Wow, this one. Hey, bowling I confidence. Yeah. I confident. I okay, confident I... that I will lose. So first question is, what is Sue's horoscope? Do you even Such know a... my birthday? No. Uh, November. 
Sagittarius. You are correct. Oh, You're the oh. wrong. But Someone that's wrong. not the question. This is <laughs> the What is your favorite phrase to say? Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, the last one. Out of ten, what will you rate your friendship? Three, two, one. Eight. Eight. Ah! I tell you, PSL best shit ever. Bobo Cha Cha. Okay, all the best for your challenge, Bobo. Thank you. Bye. Yeah. So for day one challenge, I have to say sarcastic remarks to a person, and I chose my partner for that. On a regular basis, there is a classic to him really. Because it's a Capricorn trait. Yes? Yes. Hey, baby. You finish already? No, I never, never finish. This is what I've done. And apparently, according to my horoscope, it says that Aquarius, um, we like eccentric colors, we are transitors, which I honestly do not consider myself so because literally my entire wardrobe is just blue. You can see, okay lah, maybe there are like some pop of color like right over here, but usually it's all very muted colors. So this is the final outfit. Do look like a delivery, but it's okay. Okay, so the risk that I took today is a little bit different though. Someone messaged me, I was just chatting with her back and forth, but I felt like I wanted to try and reach out to this girl more. So the risk I took was to actually share my telegram with her. I've been like guiding her through her homework. But yeah, so far it's been a very rewarding conversation. It's a very strange risk, I know, but that's that. I think this challenge uh, I sort of like can pull through uh, is because of uh, me and you, our uh, bond are very strong. My great memory wise, uh, my memory edge is is, uh, is not so good. So I think that that one uh, is really depend on people. Uh. Good morning, it is day two of the challenge. I totally bailed out on yesterday's challenge because didn't want to follow it. <laughs> okay, I just posted an IG story of like how I need help to contact Nathan Hatono. Now I'm trying to learn Nathan Hatono's electricity and then we'll tag him on IG story. <laughs> what am I doing? Apparently, being a Taurus means that I'm very stubborn. This one, I uh, have to agree lah. I'm a little bit stubborn at times. I'm just gonna leave it to Instagram. Okay, let's go! And uh, I have Brenda with me, day two outfit. Today, my life problem that I want to tell you is uh, whenever I emo, I will tend to like binge drink. La. Control himself, like you wanna drink, you can drink, but. Don't over drink until you pass out. Moderation now, basically. Yeah. So right, we go back now. Uh, ah, ah. Go on, listen. Midday, and it's time for my snacks. Okay, because I'm very hungry, right? I'm just gonna look at the results right now. We have a winner! So that means I'm gonna eat granola with soya milk. Let's get munching. Still living in the spirit of wearing like an Aquarius, and I found this piece which I have never worn before outside, and it's very artistic to me. I like it. Nope. Nope. Okay, I'm recording. Come on over here. Let me get started. One of the things that I was trying to decide on was whether or not I should get a new fan. <laughs> so I know that the answer is really just to buy a new fan. But right, being the stubborn person that I am, I have realized that I don't want to do that. <laughs> so right, the goal for today is he cannot pass out. I will I will vlog as evidence. Confirm can! Confirm can! Later that same evening. Get out! Get out! Get out! Horoscope cry! Okay, horoscope cry! I, I cannot! I cannot! I, I don't take the advice. I cannot! Bye bye. Okay, guys. So it's almost six pm, and Nita Hatuno has not replied. Oh my god! Give up. He's not gonna reply. You will need to declutter your nostalgic items. The moment I read that, my heart just sank. Uh, oh my god! This was all the badges that I collected. So there were a couple of like girls that I liked or dated. And it was a thing back then for us to exchange badges. So I do have 
four girls' school badges right here. Damn, player! Oh my god, I still got tissue paper from Pasta yeah. Mania. I didn't actually follow the wardrobe today. I forgot. <laughs> today, people shall choose which outfit I wear to sleep. This t-shirt won the polls. Okay, final verdict of this declutter thing. These are the things that I'm gonna throw, <laughs> that I'm gonna keep, and that I'm gonna keep. You cannot lah. <laughs> Can't even talk properly now. Cause like, I don't want to cry. Oh, I'm gonna cry already. Oh my god, I love it. Twelve seconds later. Such an unflattering anger, but I don't care. You know why? First later reply. <laughs> Hi guys, so it's day 3 of the challenge and today's challenge from the producer is that I have to make a few new friends My trait is that I'm a very reserved person so I need to challenge that I'm really really scared, don't know what's gonna happen Today's outfit right, I try to incorporate like neutral colours but I'm wearing white top and black pants because I don't have any more neutral coloured pants As you can see, my outfit ah, basically is very baggy, long sleeve For day 3, the challenge is to make something artistic My style of creativity is more towards uh, filmmaking lah Go to the art friend and let's go man, let's go I was struggling to find something super colourful, super vibrant and out there I managed to find this particular outfit that I actually wore for one of the uh, Korean music videos that I did with Reiner. So the makeup look we're going for today will be pinky, earthy tones. Just a lot of warm hues. Here is the finished makeup. And outfit. I tell you, those are your parents are uh, sending you to art class one, you better go and kiss your mother father. They spend a lot of money. Uh. All the stuff very expensive. Okay, hi guys. So, uh, just finished buying my stuff. So, later back home, gonna do something artistic. Okay, I am out right now. And to be honest, I feel like extra happy today, mainly because I think I'm wearing something colorful. Because they think Capricorn is a very reserved person, so I have to make friends today. Okay. But Capricorn and Aquarius don't be friends. Rejected! Okay, you'll be my friend. Yes, hi. I'm hi. Your friend. <laughs> <laughs> Write a letter to your 10 year later self with what you wish to achieve, your goals, etc. I have to agree with this trait. I am quite a planner and I often make future plans. Let's get to it. Hello, future child. Okay, I'm back at home and it is the final day of the challenge. Talk to a friend about your feelings during the day. Okay, as an Aquarius myself, I have had a hard time really expressing my feelings because I'm not sure how to do it. Plus, I'm also afraid that like people would judge. But today I'm gonna try, I'm gonna call one of my best friends via video call and I'm gonna ask him to <laughs> listen to me talk about my feelings. Today, uh, I want to share with you my feelings. I'm in an interview, oh my god. <laughs> we got, like, like right now, I got no feelings. Food satay today. Then the thing is, right, I don't know how to fry it. <laughs> Hello, future chow. Remember when you were depressed in J2 and you didn't expect to be living and breathing at 18? Well, now, you're 34. I hope you're living a life that's very meaningful in its own way. I hope you're still with your life partner and that you've continued choosing your life partner every single day. And of course, most importantly, I hope you have a family of dogs and cats. <laughs> Big love, present child. In general, I think the essence of it is that I hope I'm happy. I just want to focus on like the simplicity of life. Hi guys, I'm back home. So I'm just trying to uh, draw like cartoon characters or whatever. Let's try, let's go. This is my artwork. Okay, creative or not, not really. Uh, but yeah, I'm a bit chapalang one because I don't really know how to draw. And I also sign off lah. Please comment down below if you want this. Comment down below, man. Comment down below. How was the challenge? I think uh, whatever challenge that the producer threw at me, right, quite easy lah. So recently, I went out to drink with Brenda and, and her friends. Introduced Since to friends already, yeah. Oh. <laughs> 
think for mine, right, the challenges were like easy, medium, and difficult. Because the last one, I totally gave up. I realized that I cannot put words to my feelings. I think the hardest was the second day challenge where I have to contact like my friends. Make it happen, man. Then I go and tag him until like he reply. Tag, 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 tag. tag. He, she, he's like, what lao it now? Yeah, what lao it? So I like couldn't find much outfit from second day, like second day and third day. Never, I just never wear. Oh, what? Well, you never wear? <laughs> yeah. You never wear like an outfit. Oh yeah. So do you don't think that these horoscopes stereotypes? I was very doubtful about horoscopes being accurate to our characters, right? Now at the end of it, you know what? I'm still very doubtful lah. <laughs> Honestly, I think it boils down to personality. Just cause humans are very diverse and our personalities are not shaped around like stars. Even for say yours is Aquarius, right? Yeah. Sometimes I feel like, hey, my outfits are dressy and not too. Mm. But am I an Aquarius? No? So I got some of you, some of you, some of you, and right. you got some of us. Take some Taurus! <laughs> Take some Capricorn! Take some Cancer! Thank you for watching another episode of Singaporean's Drive. If you like this video, please remember to like, share, and subscribe. And ring our notification bell down below. If you want a part two of this video, comment down below and don't forget to watch our other videos over there. Bye! Bye. Hire me, master, hire me! <laughs>